Have you ever wondered what it takes to become a millionaire? Entering the realm of the wealthy isn't solely about accumulating piles of cash. It's a journey that begins in the mind, with the right attitude and mindset. The millionaires of the world, those who've truly earned their wealth, didn't stumble upon it by chance. No, they fostered a mindset that allowed them to seize opportunities and overcome hurdles that stood in their way. The first key to this mindset is determination. The path to millions isn't a straight line, it's a winding road filled with setbacks and detours. But the determined persevere. They stay the course, they keep their eyes on the prize, and they don't let the bumps along the way deter them. The second key is resilience. The ability to bounce back from failure is a trait every millionaire possesses. They understand that failure isn't the end, but rather a stepping stone to success. Each failure is a lesson, a guide to what doesn't work, and a stepping stone to what will. But it isn't just about determination and resilience. A positive attitude is equally crucial. Millionaires don't let negativity cloud their vision. They embrace optimism, knowing that a positive outlook breeds positive outcomes. They see the silver lining in every cloud, the opportunity in every obstacle. And that's the crux of it. Millionaires think differently. They don't see obstacles, they see opportunities. Where others see walls, they see doors. Where others see problems, they see solutions. It's this unique perspective that sets them apart and propels them towards their goals. So, if you aspire to join the ranks of the world's millionaires, start by cultivating this mindset. Foster determination, embrace resilience, and maintain a positive attitude. Remember, it's not just about the money, it's about the journey, the growth and the mindset that gets you there. Remember, becoming a millionaire starts with having the right mindset. Now let's talk about setting financial goals. Imagine embarking on a journey without a destination in mind. You'd probably end up wandering aimlessly, wouldn't you? The same principle applies to your finances. Without clear, measurable, and achievable financial goals, you're likely to drift aimlessly in a sea of financial uncertainty. So what exactly does setting financial goals entail? Firstly, it's about having a clear vision of your finances. What do you want to achieve? Is it home ownership, a comfortable retirement, or perhaps starting your own business? Your financial goals are personal to you, and they're the financial expression of your life's aspirations. Now, it's time to break down your financial goals into three categories, short-term, medium-term, and long-term goals. Short-term goals could be anything you wish to achieve within the next year. Maybe you're planning to save for a vacation, pay off a small debt, or start an emergency fund. Medium-term goals are ones you hope to accomplish within the next one to five years. This might include saving for a down payment on a house or starting a business. Long-term goals, on the other hand, are the big-ticket items. Retirement savings, paying off your mortgage, or building a hefty investment portfolio. These are goals that take more than five years to achieve. But setting these goals is only half the battle. You also need to act on them. This is where saving and investing come into play. Consistently setting aside a portion of your income for savings is a vital step towards reaching your short-term and medium-term goals. As for your long-term goals, investing is your best bet. Through the power of compound interest, your money can grow exponentially over time, bringing you closer to your millionaire dreams. Remember, your financial goals aren't set in stone. They're dynamic and should change as your life and circumstances do. Review them regularly and adjust as needed. After all, they are your goals and they should serve you, not the other way around. Setting clear financial goals is the roadmap to your millionaire journey. One key strategy to becoming a millionaire is creating multiple income streams. A millionaire mindset isn't just about earning, it's about earning smart. It's about not putting all your eggs in one basket, but rather diversifying your income. This way, you're not solely reliant on one source of income, which decreases risk and increases potential returns. So what exactly are these multiple income streams? Well, let's delve into a few examples. Firstly, rental income. If you own a property and rent it out, the rent paid by your tenants becomes a steady income source. It's like having a business that operates without your constant supervision. Next, dividends from investments. When you invest in stocks, bonds, or mutual funds, you not only benefit from potential price appreciation, but also from dividends. These are payments made by companies to their shareholders, typically on a regular basis. It's like your money is working for you even while you sleep. Then there's the side business or side hustle as it's popularly known. 
This could be anything from selling handmade crafts, offering freelance services, or even setting up a small online store. The beauty of a side hustle is that it allows you to pursue your passion while also earning from it. Another income stream to consider is royalties from intellectual property. This could be from a book you've written, a song you've composed, or a patent you've developed. Every time your work is used or sold, you earn a royalty. And lastly, peer-to-peer -peer lending or crowdfunding. By lending money to individuals or small businesses in return for interest, you can create yet another income stream. Remember, the goal isn't to create multiple income streams overnight, it's a journey. One that requires patience, diligence, and smart decision-making. But the rewards are worth it. Having a diverse income portfolio not only provides financial security, but also opens up opportunities for increased wealth. Multiple income streams can accelerate your path to becoming a millionaire. And who knows, with the right mindset, strategies, and actions, you might just reach that seven-figure mark sooner than you think. Becoming a millionaire isn't just about earning more, it's also about smart spending and saving. The idea of budgeting may seem tedious or restrictive to some, but in reality, it's a tool for financial freedom. It's about understanding where your money goes and making intentional decisions. Here's a simple way to look at it. Imagine your income as a pie. A budget helps you decide how you want to slice that pie and where each piece should go. Living below your means is another key principle. It's not about depriving yourself, but about making thoughtful choices. This might mean choosing a modest car over a luxury one, or cooking at home more often than eating out. It's about prioritizing your long-term financial goals over short-term gratification. Saving is the next crucial step. Think of saving not as something you do with what's left after spending, but as an expense in itself. A portion of your income should be set aside regularly as if you're paying your future self. Investing is where the magic happens, it's making your money work for you. When you invest, your money has the potential to grow exponentially over time, thanks to the power of compound interest. Avoiding unnecessary debt is equally important. While some debts, like a mortgage or student loans, can be considered as investments in your future, others, like credit card debt, can be dangerous. It's essential to differentiate between good and bad debt and to manage it wisely. Smart spending decisions are also key. This means being conscious of where your money goes. It could be as simple as comparing prices before making a purchase or as significant as deciding not to buy something you don't really need. Remember, every penny you save or spend wisely is a step closer to building your millionaire fortune. And it all starts with creating a budget, living below your means, saving and investing a portion of your income, avoiding unnecessary debt, and making smart spending decisions. Smart spending and saving habits will help build your millionaire fortune. Lastly, never stop learning and improving. This is the final but no less important piece of the puzzle to becoming a millionaire. The financial world is constantly evolving and so should we. It's not enough to rest on our laurels once we've grasped a few investing basics or have a couple of income streams set up. Instead, we should always look for ways to expand our knowledge and improve our skills. Think about it. The world of finance is a vast ocean, continuously ebbing and flowing with market trends, financial news, and investment opportunities. If we don't keep up, we can quickly find ourselves out of depth. Therefore, staying updated with these changes is not just a suggestion, it's a necessity. Now you might be wondering, how do I begin? Well, good news, there's a wealth of resources out there you can tap into. From books written by financial gurus to online courses and seminars, there's no shortage of learning materials to help you stay in the know. But learning isn't just about consuming information, it's also about learning from experience, both ours and others. This is where mentors come in. A mentor, someone who's already navigated the financial waters, can provide invaluable insights and guidance. They've been where you are and have made the mistakes so you don't have to. There's a saying, a wise man learns from his mistakes, but a wiser man learns from others' mistakes. And in the journey to becoming a millionaire, it pays to be the wiser man. So let's wrap this up. Becoming a millionaire isn't a one-time event. It's a lifelong commitment to learning and improving. It's about staying informed, being open to new ideas, seeking guidance from those who've walked the path before us, and constantly honing our financial skills. 
Continual learning and improvement is the key to maintaining and growing your millionaire status. And with that, we've completed our journey. But remember, this is only the beginning of yours.